guys. Sandy Bell with my fairy treasures. Okay, you guys. Oh my gosh. I have hit the mother load at Hobby Lobby. They finally really got after the clearances. Thank goodness. I've just been putting along and now somebody must have got on their butt and said, get this stuff clearanced out. So we're on our way. The only thing I'm still looking to go, go to is I want to look at the paper. Not a lot of paper, just a couple of different things on the paper, the bags, and then the planner stuff. And then I'm done with this sale. Okay. All right, so let's just, let me put this ahead and we'll just start attacking this bag. This bag has a ton of stuff in it. Okay, how many of these did I get? Let me see. One, two, three. I think I got three. Okay, so these were $4.99. Got them for $1.24. Yeah. Isn't that fabulous? Look how beautiful these bottles are. These are going to be so fabulous in my mixed media. And also, wouldn't this make a beautiful necklace? Put one of those. They're called eye pens. That's what I was trying to think of in my last video. Put an eye pen. Put a little bit of um, E6000 on the, uh, on the eye pen at the bottom. And then just stick it in here. And now you can hang it and make it into a necklace. Wouldn't that be a beautiful, like, long necklace? Yeah. Fabulous. So $4.99. Got them for $1.24. That's why I picked up three, you guys. $1.24. Also, for my, I do, I'm going to do mixed media with these also. Like three-dimensional mixed media. Um, then I got the smaller ones. Let's see. Did I only get one of these? I think I got I got two of these, but um, that was in another haul or another bag, I think. Let me just make sure. Yeah. So I did get two of these. Um, $2.99. cents. That's crazy. Again, you can do the same. Put that eye pin in and hang them. And these can be charms. I wouldn't do a whole bracelet of this, but like on the toggle, this could be like your main big charm on your toggle, which I think would be really cool. You can even make a necklace and have this be a charm. Be beautiful. Okay, I picked up, I think, oh, I'm going to break these. Uh, three of these, I believe. Yes, I got three. Again, $4.99, and they were only $1.24. Again, I want to do some 3D type of um, mixed media projects, and I needed bottles. So I'm so glad that I found these. And at $1.24, we're, we're at Dollar Tree prices. A penny less than Dollar Tree prices. So $4.99, $1.24. Isn't that fabulous? You can't... You hate to spend the money, but, like, you can't help yourself. Like, these prices... This happens one time a year, and it's insane. Um, It's not in this haul, but I picked up... It might be in this haul. Oh, it is. I picked up three of these. Uh, one for myself and then two for giveaways. But aren't, aren't these, isn't this fat? Look, I'll go this way with it so you can see it. I love this. Um, I love this uh, sign, this stencil and this sign. Isn't it beautiful? Uh, two ninety nine, eighty seven cents. It'll be great for my um, mixed media. It'll be great for my jelly plate. It'll be great for all of it. Okay. Then I picked up a crap load of these. I picked up five. They're regularly $3.99. I got them for 99 cents. 99 cents? Yes, ma'am. Now, the reason I picked up so many of these, I do fabric flowers. And when I make fabric flowers, um, you need a flower center. So, look it. It would have cost me $4 to get make half flower centers before. But now they're 99 cents. Yeah. I went ahead and got five packs. One, two, three, four, five. They'll make beautiful flower centers. And there's 16 in each pack. So five of these. That's a lot of flower centers. That's making a lot of flowers. Okay. Again, for flower centers, they only had three. And this I left because they had a lot of these. So I still left some more on the peg. This I did take all what they had because they, they had only three. Again, flower centers. Regularly $3.99. Got them for 99 cents. How beautiful they are aren't they gorgeous all of those are going to be some gorgeous flower centers love okay and then oh i didn't realize i was almost done with this bag okay there's one two one two three four four of these this is and i i do art journaling mostly but i i now what i've started doing is adding junk journaling to my art journaling and you can do a lot of cool stuff with envelopes. So, um, and so, and these are nice quality envelopes too. So, and they're in gray. And I think what I'm going to do is coffee stain these and do some Tim Holtz distressing on them. I'm going to do all kinds of stuff to them. Um, at any rate, these were only $1.24. Uh, and they're regularly $4.99. I got them for $1.24. And they're way high, more high quality envelopes than when you just buy the ones like at 
Dollar Tree. So I picked up four packs of these. And I wish I would have picked these up when they first went on clearance. They've been on clearance for weeks, and I didn't get them. Because I would have loved to have gotten the cart, the uh, the brown ones, the craft paper ones. But we're fine. I'm going to coffee stain these gray ones. The, the gray plus the coffee stain, it's going to look fabulous. Okay, so I got four of those. With Hobby Lobby and all their changes, oh, God, girls, this may be the last year that we have the clearances this good. I mean, they've been doing these kind of clearances like this, um, January, February, March, April, for like the last five years. But they are, they're just shrinking down the craft section and the fine art section, so I don't know if they're going to keep having all this. Okay, wait, I'm trying to keep some stuff separate. Okay, this is all, yeah, this is the first bag I went through. Okay. Up there and put these up here. All right. Next. Let me see how long I've been on here for. Okay. Um, more stencils. I got this horse, which I love. Two twenty nine for fifty seven cents. I can draw horses, but it'd be kind of cool. Sometimes if I can just stencil it, if I can just um, use my stencil, which would be really cool. And then all I have to do is paint inside of it and create the horse, which would be really cool. So I got that one. Um, I am obsessed with crosses. They only had one. If they would have had more, I would have picked up more for giveaways and stuff too. But $3.49.87. And I love to use crosses in my mixed media. I just think crosses are absolutely beautiful. And these crosses are gorgeous. Making sure you guys are seeing them. So excited about that. I did pick up two more of these for giveaways. This is regularly $3.49.87. You can't beat that for stencils. Stencils can be expensive. Stencils can be like $12. $10. And I love... I forgot what this sign is. Someone will tell me in the... In the... Uh, in the um, comments. I love this. Okay, so again, $3.49.87. Oh, I love this stamp. And they had this stamp last year, and I passed it up like a fool. Um, this is so great for my mixed media, for the backgrounds. I love stamps like this. I love any type of script. And last year, I passed up on it, and I don't know why I did that. Anyway, and it's all like uh, book pages and newspaper and dictionary, and it's all kind of collaged. Uh, regularly, this is an expensive, look how big this stamp is. Uh, what was the regular price? Where's the regular price? Okay, I want to find the regular price on it. I got it for $374, so that's a good deal, because I know this was probably $10 or $12. Usually the price is like right here. Where the heck is the price? All right, I don't know what this was, but I can guarantee you it was nowhere near 370. Oh, wait, it might, no, it's not on here because it would be, let me just make sure it's not behind this sticker. No, because that would interrupt the design. But I can guarantee you this, it was 10, 12 bucks easily. And maybe more than that, because we're talking 75% off everything, right? So this was probably, I don't know, it was over $10. Okay, 374. Fabulous, get this in your life. Especially if you do mixed media. This is needed. Oh, I was so excited about this. And I almost didn't take these. But I said, Angela, I like to make jewelry. I don't know if people know that. But I used to be a jewelry maker. And I used to make jewelry and sell it in different stores here in Las Vegas. I had that business for like two or three years. I got burnt out, but I really loved it. Um, and I haven't made jewelry for a while. But I want to make a little bit of jewelry for myself. Um, this is... Uh, metal what is it called metal gallery regularly $15.99 I got this for two dollars and 49 cents you want to talk this is that's more than 75 percent I'm sure I'm pretty sure that's more cheaper than 75 percent anyway I got three of them look at this is that fabulous or what you guys chain and it's a like a um 
it's a very antique looking chain. Isn't that beautiful? And I got three of them. So I spent $7.50. And if I would have done this, 15 and 15 is 30 plus another. This has been like 45, 40, $45 worth of chain. And I got it for $7. Yeah, that's more than 75%. Um, a long, it says elongated curb chain spool antique brass. Yeah, it's very antique looking. And how many yards? Six yards, you guys. Fabulous. And I was picked up all three of them. They had three. I picked up all three. I was like, girl, I want to get into some of my jewelry making for myself. So I got a lot of jewelry that I want to make. So, okay. And I think, okay, now we're into ooh, a bunch of good stuff here. Oh, I did get two of these, I think. Oh, good, because I wanted to give one in a giveaway. Um, this was regularly $3.99. Got it for $0.99. Cents. It's just a key stamp, but I love it. And I'm glad I ended up getting two of them because I wanted to do one for giveaways. Okay. Here's a bunch of good stuff right here. Oh, I forgot. Oh, I picked up a lot of these. I this is oh, I'm glad because I want to make a charm. I want to make a charm necklace and a charm bracelet. Lots of charm bracelets and charm necklaces for myself. So regularly six ninety nine dollar seventy four. And I picked some more of these up the of these up earlier in my other vid in my other video. But that's fine because I also want to make charm necklaces. So now I have more, so I can do. I can uh, definitely make char charm necklaces and. And charm bracelets. It says, I woke up like this. Look at this little, look at this um, faux diamond ring. Isn't that fabulous? This is a lipstick. And this says flawless. Oh, love it. Love it. What is this? Look at this. I picked up quite a few of these. They're cameos. Let me see if I can't run into I think I picked up three or two. Let me see. Maybe I got two. I don't know if I got two or three. All right, well, we got two right now. We might run into some more. Um, look at these cameos. Oh, I can't. I'm making a necklace out of this, out of one of these, for sure. Isn't that fabulous? In fact, I'm going to make two necklaces. I want to make a necklace that's really long to, like, my belly button, and then one shorter so that people can actually see it. Look at that. And that's going to go so good with my chain if I decide to do it that way. Or I may decide to do it with beads. I'm not sure. But either way. Well, I will do this one with the chain long. Oh, that'll be gorgeous. Because the the bezel around here is the same as that. That's going to look fabulous. Uh, did I tell you the price? $0.99, cents, regularly $4.99. This one is regularly $6.99, $1.74. just like to make sure I tell you guys the prices. Because I can't stand that when I'm watching someone's video and they just don't even care to talk about the prices. I'm like, hello, the prices are the whole reason I'm watching this. I need to know what's going on at Hobby Lobby and what are the prices. Anyway, it's people, people have their own channels. They can do what they want. But we want to know the prices, girls. Okay, so I got two of these. I think these are gorgeous. $9.99 regularly. Got it from $2.24. I bought two of them. Look, aren't these beautiful? And I thought these would be so beautiful, um, again, as a charm bracelet and a charm necklace. I mean, look at those. Those are ridiculous. Oh, love. This is cool. This was regularly $5.99. Got it for $1.24. And they say, believe, love, faith, and hope. Again, charm bracelet. Charm necklace. I wanted to make charm bracelets and necklaces last year, and I never got to it. But I'm doing it this year. I am doing it. I'm going to start soon. Okay, I got, um, I think, two or three of these. Look how beautiful this is. Isn't this gorgeous? I definitely want to do an, uh, earrings out of this, out of one set, and a necklace out of the other set. A long necklace and then a shorter necklace. So $13.99. These were $13.99. Got them for $1.49. That's crazy. Make sure I'm in frame. Yeah, I am. Look how and look how aurora borealis it is. Look how it she has the colors. Absolutely gorgeous. Oh, I got another one of these. 
perfect i'll have enough to do the charm bracelet and the charm necklace i'm so excited this i thought was really cool and did i tell you yeah 13.99 got it for dollar 49 this is regularly 5.99 got it for dollar 24 i thought this would make on, on a piece of uh suede rope how cool would that be at the bottom of the suede rope and just this and then do another one with this being like in the center on a piece of suede rope and then do beads on the on the sides and do have all beads so i thought this could be really cool so excited about that look at these i think these are gorgeous did i just did i get one or two this seems like something i would have gotten two of but maybe i just got one uh regularly 9 224 these things that were two, that were 10 bucks and now they're two this is a fabulous deal $9.99, Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? Aren't they beautiful? Again, just gorgeous. Oh, this is going to be the most gorgeous charm bracelet. And I can mix stuff. Like, I can mix this and I can mix these on my charm bracelet. I mean, how gorgeous. Is oh, I just can't even wait. I'm going to be making jewelry like an insane person because I'm excited. I'm excited to make it. And then this is... Uh, regularly $9.99 got it for $2.49 look how beautiful that is isn't that gorgeous and you can put a picture a photo in here 1.5 1.5 by 1.8 what I thought I would want to do is um I have I'm I do um I draw my I draw I do mixed media and I draw these girls and I put them in my mixed media so I do these different paintings and so I was thinking of of uh printing one out and doing them really nice and small and putting some of my artwork in there wouldn't that be cool so that's what I'm gonna do with that and then these were such a good price. I picked up three of them. I just hit my camera. Did I get myself out of frame? No, I'm fine. Let's go back here. Okay. I bought three of these. This is fabulous. These were uh, $7.99 for $1.12. Look at that. Isn't that fabulous? Oh. I just thought, oh my goodness, a dollar twelve. I was like, yeah, this has to happen. This would be gorgeous just to wear. I will wear this just on its own, and then I will turn one of these into a charm uh, necklace, and then I'll probably turn one into a charm bracelet. Let me look at the things. Oh yeah, I can just take links off if I want to turn this into a charm bracelet. And what a solid charm bracelet! Look at the chain. That chain is everything. It changes everything in a bag of chips. That's why I got three of them. There was only three there, and I took all three. I was like, yeah, that, that has to happen. Okay. So let's put this away. Do I have another bag? Yeah, I got one more bag. Put all these. I'm so glad she took all the little, this little precious stuff like this and put it in a separate bag to give it some protection. You guys, run, do not walk to Hobby Lobby when you're done watching this because I'm telling you, the prices, no, well, you guys are seeing it. The prices are insane. They're just insane. You just, it's one time a year. You have to do it. You just have to do it. Okay. Next. Oh, more paint. Yes. Let me get some water. How much time have we been on here for? Perfect. Okay. So let me show you. I got more paint. Okay, I bought. Okay, I bought four of these. And let me tell you why. I do a lot of. Um, I make my own paper. Um, I do jelly printing, and I do mixed media, so I use a lot of paint. But I do jelly printing, so I make a ton of my own papers. And I make my papers look like old walls, old doors. Like, it was dug up out of the ground. I, I, it's very grungy type of style that I love doing. So, uh, this um, Anita's paint. I think they're going to stop carrying it. Um, this is a bronze color. This is one of my main colors I use in almost every jelly print I do. Because it gives you that old world, aged, grunge old wall, old door look, right? So that's why I got this. And um, it's eight ounces. It's bronze. It was regularly $3.79 and I got it for 99 cents. Look at the color. 
Look at that. And I usually will go to, I usually buy Master's Touch because I love their uh, bronze color. And, you know, even on sale, even when it's 40, 40 or 50% off, it'll still cost me about $3.50. I just got it for 99 cents. So I am so excited. And this is one of my favorite colors to use in my mixed media and on my jelly plate. And when you do jelly plating, you go through a lot of paint. Okay. Oh, and I picked up three more of these. Okay, this is black paint. And I picked up a crap load of this black paint. But black is your main one of your main things you use. It's like white. They never have black paint and they never have white paint. And they have folk art. Folk art acrylic paint is, is probably the top of the line of, a, of the craft paints. It's thicker. It's almost as thick of, as an artist paint. And I do also a thing called uh, Donna Dewberry One Stroke Flowers. And you have to use her folk art paints because you need a thicker paint. And so um, that's why I picked up quite a bit of folk art. $8.29, got it for $207. Is that insane? And I got three of them. So just crazy, crazy, crazy good prices, you guys. You guys, just like I said run do not walk to hobby lobby get there right now if you can and just take advantage of these sales they're just ridiculous um and watch all the hobby lobby hauls because then you can know what's in the stores and what you're looking for and what the prices are it really helps all right you guys that is it for this one if you haven't subscribed to my channel i'd love for you to do so if you can give this video a thumbs up any comments or questions leave them below come visit me on facebook and instagram and i will talk to you guys in the next video bye guys